I was praying for a friend this morning and the words and this word picture came to mind of these waves that were just crashing down and, and then the undercurrent was slamming you on the ground. I don't know if you've ever been in the ocean and had that happen. And you're tired and you're wet and you want to get up and you basically you want to get out. So you may be feeling that way, that you're in a situation, a job, a relationship, and all you feel is you keep getting beat down. And the undercurrent's so strong you don't know if you can ever get out. I said, Lord, what is the answer for that? And the Lord ever so gently said, just float. Try trusting me. Float. Rest. Let go. And let me. Someone may need this right now. Whatever that means, whatever's crashing you, you're wet and you're tired and the, the wave, it just seems like one wave of circumstance after another just keeps beating you down. That's your word. Let go, let God, and try floating. What does floating mean? Ultimately, if you think of floating, this is what I mean by that. Enter his presence. Enter his presence with worship and praise, no matter what it is, and let him carry you. Let him take you to the next move. And I'll realize that you'll find as you're in his presence, as you're floating, something will happen. You'll regain your strength. You'll be able to go forward. So, that's for you today. You're in the vine moment thought because you're meant to be in the vine. You're meant to be in the sweet spot. It doesn't matter about what's in your bank account or it doesn't matter your circumstances. You, my friend, are meant to be in the sweet spot.